let me speak to uh, Lord Kome himself and, and take some further thoughts on him on this matter. Hello, good evening, sir. Welcome to Eyewitness. This is quite an, an interesting and important report coming at such a crucial time for the, the, the fight against Galamse. And here you are, prominently featured in this report as one of those who uh, supported illegal mining or interfered with the fight against the menace. Obviously, I've had your, your written response, or we've seen your written response. But, you know, what else do you have to say about this particular Your name has been mentioned. Uh, um, what else do you have to say about this particular report? First of all, um, Salam, good evening to you and to your cherished listeners. Um, <laughs> it's interesting that I'm, I'm told that this report was submitted in 2021. Nobody has called my attention to it. Uh, very interesting indeed. And um, it's not something that I would have even dignified it with the response. So seriously, I, I, I really doubt whether indeed Professor from Pompuatin wrote that. And granted that he wrote that, uh, whether he's in his right frame of mind. Because this is, this is, this is a minister that I have never spoken to him before in my life. You heard it. <laughs> and uh, I wish you could put him online. You've never, never spoken to ever. Professor Frimpon Boatin ever never in your life. To Professor Frimpon Boatin in my life. You Not heard it. as minister and responsible for the sector or national, never. I have been national organizer of this party for years. Okay? <laughs> when I knew him, all through to becoming a minister of state and thereafter, never ever have I spoken to him in my life. So I don't know what he's talking about. In any case, which of them is he tagging me with? That I'm the frontal person or I am, I am the influencer or the interfering person or that I am the main person? It's, 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 it's ridiculous, okay? And in fact, he should, he, should, he should not play on the minds of Ghanaians. This is a whole professor, okay, highly respected in the Ghanaian society, that the president gives you a tax Okay, and a huge tax as one. What did I hear you read? That he was trying to accuse the president of total disregard? For goodness sake. Well, was he the one who advised the president to set up an interministerial committee in the first place? For him to now call it total disregard. The man who sets the committee up, if, we were, if he were not serious and didn't mean it, he would have set it up and appointed you? The president had, 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 had some serious confidence in you. That is why he put you there. You failed. And instead of bowing down your heads in shame and accepting the responsibility, you try to throw names around. I am not part of the names that he's going to throw around. But, 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 but just, to, just, just to correct this, I'm not sure he accuses the president of disregarding his own directive. Otherwise, what he what says he, what is, is he that... To say? Yeah, what he's actually saying is that people in the party or people in government, influential people, disregard the pronouncements and wishes of the president. Who is more, who is more influential than him... Okay, as a minister of state, a cabinet minister of that of that of that nature, having having an inter interministerial committee means that there are other cabinet ministers with he as chairman. Other okay, cabinet ministers, has, other was, cabinet was, ministers, he said, you know, abandoned their role and and left well, himself and a few well, others to they, do the work. They, they, they can respond for themselves. I I have been director of operations since 2017. Okay, when the president set this committee up. Okay, the president, in his own wisdom, thought that he wouldn't want to add his diet of operations to this to this committee, and so be it. Never ever, <laughs> okay. And I repeat it, never ever. In any case, I had I had about some two three weeks ago that he was throwing some 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 wild accusations around, and the president had asked the CID headquarters to investigate that. Okay, so he should go there and face it. And then if he has the balls to mention my name, I would meet him there. Okay, he has to prove beyond reasonable doubts. I am not the type that people can just run around throwing my name around and get away with it. Mm. Especially so far as that his, uh, his, 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 uh, his terms of reference of managing this whole very important uh, uh, operation is contained. I am not part of it. I couldn't have been part of it. And, and, and he should come again. Honestly, mm. I have a lot of respect for him, but in this one, I think he goofed, and he owes the Ghanaian people an apology. I would not speak for anyone, I speak for myself. 
I, 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 I see. But, but, but for many, is it not curious that of all, you know, of, of the number of people in government, you, your name comes up as one of the very few who got mentioned in this report? Doesn't that, well, you know... Well, he, uh, he, he says amongst others. Mm -hmm. Is that what I heard from you? So, I mean, the, the, let me take that paragraph again. I am not referring to party people who had their legitimate concession mm -hmm. and were mining sustainably as they were instructed to do. There are mm -hmm. appointees in the Jubilee House that are doing or supporting illegal mining or interfering mm. with the fight against the menace. Examples are Lord Comey, your name came first, uh, Charles Niteko, and Frank Asiedu Bequin, uh, also known as Protozoa. So, so your, your, your name comes up. And so, for he many, it, so he gave examples. Yes. Okay. And therefore, probably means that there are many people in his mind that he wants to mention. If the order is anything to go by, I mean, sometimes it's the most prominent that comes first. So it means that amongst the names that are well, mentioned, well, you are very prominent. The name, the name Lord Come is prominent. Mm, and in your role, and, and perhaps your role in this allegation Lord as well. Come, Lord Come is an old name in Ghana's political structure since 1992. Mm. So, yes, <laughs> it's a prominent name. <laughs> but that's why I asked whether indeed he was in his right frame of mind. Somebody I've not even spoken. You heard what I told you. I said, I've not spoken to Professor Frimpong Boateng in my life. But, but, but uh, uh, Mr. Comey, I mean, you, you, don't, you don't need to speak to him to interfere, you allegedly, to to or to support then illegal mining. He's, saying? No, he's no, talking no. about influence. Yes, okay? but you don't so need to. Wait, from him. wait, wait. He, he's not here. When we get him, we'll put those to him. But you don't need to know somebody. To, to influence a person. You can influence a person through other people. You can interfere in a process, not by yourself and him, but you can do that through other means. So the fact that you've, not, you've, not, you've never spoken to him ever in your life does not necessarily exculpate you from this allegation. The point he's making is that you support illegal mining and you interfere with the fight against the menace. You could take many forms. Excellent. And that is why he should come again. <laughs> okay, but which is what I told you. Mm. He needs to come again and then be clear on what he wants to say. Very well. I think he just, will come. Just but, but, throwing yes. names around, okay, and that makes it even difficult, okay, for people to understand what you mean. Mm. Cannot be enough. He is a professor, for goodness sake. And I'm saying that if what you're saying. Okay, is anything to go by? I mean, how did the influence come about? If he says that Lord Comey is involved and I'm the main person, I'm sure he was in charge of uh, uh, all these things. He should know various concessions and their names and the, where it is cited and all those things. He should come again. And that is why I'm challenging him to come again. I, I see. Okay. But, but, as, but director, as, said, yeah, as, yeah. as director of operations at the presidency, and you've been doing so for the past, I mean, since 2017, my memory serves me right. Uh, hasn't there been any incident or occasion where somebody perhaps uh, who wants to genuinely, who wanted to genuinely do business or engage in mining, you know, ever approach you to help him go through the process? Haven't we uh, had any such incident? I'm sure, I'm sure you heard that I told you that the president in his own wisdom decided that even as his director of operations, and with a with a with an operation of this of this nature, he will not get me involved. Yes, so but, I advised myself accordingly. Yes, but the, 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 okay, the, point, I the point knew, is, I knew I knew my man, and I knew how he knows me and how I know him. No, but so I think I, the point I'm making is, for example, you are director of operations at the presidency. I mean, there is a name, there's a way names work in Ghana. Maybe I I am, I, I am a local somewhere. I want to engage in mining. I know you are not a member of the committee, but you could know somebody who knows the committee. So you don't need to be a member of the committee to assist me to get a hearing with a member of the committee. Well, that doesn't as, make for, as, for, as for people coming up with all sorts of uh, requests and, and, and ways for you to help them, we receive them many, many times from all quarters. So, so some, of those some of those requests, some of those requests certainly were on the issues of mining and of securing course, concessions. There are there have been many issues about mining when this whole operation started. So oh, what, many, when... many, 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 many. But then if you come to me with a request and I can't help you, I can't help you. And that is why I can tell you that he, Professor from Bomboate, okay, I'm sure if I had called him, there will be, there will be uh, the call lock I can trace from wherever, whether it's MTN or Vodafone, I have told you, I stated categorically, if somebody comes to me for me to intervene, okay, uh, which probably he would want to call it interference. I I must have called him. I mean, and I'm saying that this is a man that I've never called him before in my life. 
that, that, that point is well made. So, it's, so, very yes. no, 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 it's, it's a serious point that you should take it serious. No, no, I, I, in fact, I, I've, in fact I, I've, I've noted it, that you've never yes. ever spoken to Professor Akuma Barton in your life. Means that, and therefore means that if somebody had come to me to say that, can you intervene? Intervene in what? Okay? Probably he's a, he's a person that I needed to speak to. And I'm saying that I'm not spoken to him before. So I couldn't have called him on any, although I received many of these complaints and the, and the, and the situation that at times were messy at the time. Okay, at his own instance, I never bothered to call him. And I knew why I never bothered to call him. Because the president didn't add me to the committee, I decided on principle not to be part of it in any form or shape. And that is me. Mm, yeah, I, I get the point. But you see, yes. the, po the point I'm also making to you is that you do not need to speak to him. Maybe you, you know what you were doing. If, if I want assistance, maybe a member of the committee was your friend. Maybe the secretary to the committee was your friend. So once you could get something done through the secretary or another member of the committee, you did not need to speak to somebody you've never spoken to in your life for you to start exchanging pleasantries, for you to start building trust, for the person to trust you and now begin to help you. So, given your position and all that you've done in the party and in our politics, you are hugely influential and hugely popular. If you called up a member of the committee, one of your colleagues, maybe a minister, and told him that this friend of mine has this difficulty, what can you do for me? And that friend, knowing in you, also goes ahead to speak to the good old professor that uh, this is Lord Kwame's person, can we assist him? And the professor deems that to be you interfering in the process. I'm not sure it is enough to just say, because you've not spoken to him before, ever in your life, you could not have been said to have interfered in the process or supported illegal mining. Well, I, started, I started by asking you to ask him to come again, okay, and then come with some clarity on what he means. Mm. And I'm sure that should answer your question. He's the one throwing those allegations around. Mm. And it's important, I cannot speak for him, I cannot defend what he's saying. He, he, he understands what he's saying, and I think it's important that he comes again. He should be able to 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 to, to clear himself and tell the good people of Ghana. I'm, I'm sure that now that further, he's been invited further by and the... better, further and better particulars is necessary in this. Uh, exactly so. And therefore, and therefore, probably means that he will come back and say, "Well, I, Lord Kwame didn't speak to me directly. He spoke to Kofi Mensa, and Kofi Mensa came." And I mean, those things also can be interrogated. Uh, I'm, I think I'm sure. Yes. That I put it on record mm. based on what he has just written. Mm -hmm. I think that it's something that, well, but as I said, uh, it's, it's, it's news. So certainly one, one has to stay the case. And then Lord, Lord, Lord Kome is newsy. So as Lord Kome is involved, that, you can be sure that the interest will be huge. But, but they, 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 yes, they, they, I think that it's important, yes, it's the other important point, that I make, I make that revealing statement. Yes, that you've never that, spoken that, to him ever in your life. That, 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 that is noted. And I'm sure from tomorrow, I'm him? sure from tomorrow, the headlines and will be screaming that you've never spoken to him before. I couldn't have asked him for any favor. Yes, uh, we, we, for goodness sake. That, that is clear. But I'm also and saying somebody, that... And if somebody had gone to him to say, Lord Comet said I should come and see you, then that must be a liar. Mm, that, that is well. Because, that, that's fine. Because he could have, he could have, he could have contacted me back and said, "Ah, but somebody is here with me." He says he's coming from your office. Blah 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 blah. We have not spoken before, and I think it's important that I put it on record. V very okay. well. So, so case, we, we won't believe that. Case, as he said, um, the president had asked the CID to 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 delve into some allegations earlier on that he had made and probably these are issues that he can add add it on and therefore we would all be invited and certainly we would meet him there if we meet him there in an interrogation i'm sure there are there are there are bodies uh, institutions in this country who, who, who do these investigations and delve it out and they will submit their reports otherwise we meet in court for goodness sake his reputation as a professor, highly respected in this country. My my reputation as a as a politician also in this country needs to be respected. You cannot just go around and be throwing names around without without merit, without evidence, wild allegations, and 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 just mentioning people's name after uh, after you had left office. What are we talking about? No, no, but, but it, it's also... When we assign people jobs to do in this country. Uh, it's also important okay. to point out that this report is not new. It was authored uh, uh, close to two years ago, uh, and it was authored on the order of the chief of staff. Indeed, that was the opening uh, have you uh, comment. Guys, have you guys even found out whether indeed this is a, a report that he had submitted to chief of staff? Mm. No, we, we are reliably informed that, that it's, it's been submitted. So, so that, that well, we, 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 we can deal with I'm that. Sure 
I'm sure you need to do your double checking because, as I said, they, they, I report 2021 or so. I I am a staff of Jubilee House, uh, up and down from from ground floor to fourth floor, moving left, right, and center. You no, know, I, I I've never heard of any any report, especially when it had my name in there. But it's not every report. We are, we are I'm sure when when action is to be taken on the report, you 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 will be called. I mean, I'm I'm, I'm quite certain. I'm, I'm quite certain about that. And I'm also sure that when I mean, there's once the CID is on this, and now that this report has action come out, taking uh, uh, you know, when you have left when you have left office. No, but the but point is, he was asked have... according to him to to provide a report after he left office, and this were his his reflections, and these were things he thought uh, if 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 looked at could help the fight. So, so we 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 we'll leave that. They, they they will work on it, not to believe that. I can speak for myself. Exactly. It's I, that, I, I, that I get that. That reiterate my position. Mm -hmm. That I respect him. I have, I have a lot of regard for him on this matter of me, my involvement or my fronting or my interfering. I think he goofed. Very well. But you know, speaking about cross checking and all of that, have you also tried to verify from him if indeed he authored this and the authenticity of same? I, I get the point that you've not spoken to him before, but it's always the yeah, first time. Have you tried yeah. to contact him to be sure that indeed this came from him and he meant what he said? Why, why would I try contacting him when, 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 when I'm told that he's the one who leaked, leaked a so-called report that you are reading to me and all that? But why not? Your, your name is there, so why, why not? Just to be double sure as well. Well, I, I, I'll respond appropriately like I'm doing. Very well. And so I'm you, you that, yes. I'm expecting that if he goes to CID and he, and he mentions my name and proves... He, he provides the evidence. We will we'll all meet. I I see. So just, just before is, you just just before you go, your general thoughts on the law will take this course. Very well. Your, your general thoughts. Do do, do you? I, I know you've you've. I guess you've read the report. Reading the report, I mean, was so concerning to me. Do you get the impression after reading the report that we've lost the fight? You know, as a people, the fight against Galam. Say, you think we've lost? I it? don't think we've lost the fight. People, people who 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 were put in charge were the ones who failed. Mm, there were 10 ministers that. of state, cabinet well, ministers for that matter, well, failed. Well, I'm saying, the he, Professor Pompon Party, was the main man responsible. Mm. Okay? He was the main man responsible, of course, with some other aides, mm. which is where other ministers come in. I'm saying that those that you put in charge, mm. okay, should be held responsible, okay? Because, see, we are running an executive presidency in this country, where the president, as one single individual, cannot be everywhere. That is why he appoints ministers. And that's why he appoints people like us, okay, with our jobs cut out for us. We should be able to be bold, courageous enough and take up the responsibility. When we fail, we fail. And we accept the responsibility that we failed. This business of people running for cover and trying to blame everybody around them when things are not working well and good for them, okay? People should be able to be bold and resign from positions. Okay, he has been there for 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 God knows when. But, in the well. midst of all this, he didn't resign. Mm. Okay, he didn't because he could have resigned to say, "Well, <laughs> these things that are happening is beyond." Mr. President, take uh, take up your job. Okay, he sat down. We ended our first time. It so happens that his name was not mentioned again for the second time. Now you come back, and then all you do is to mention names and 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 try to fault everybody except yourself. What are we talking about here? Okay, you fought everybody except yourself, and you think that you should be forgiven? For goodness sake, we cannot continue to run this country like this. Okay, and, and it, it is not about an NDC or an MPP matter. The structure of our constitution, the structure of our governance is such that presidents will, will continue forever, appoint people to positions of trust. Very well. Thanks so much. And they should be held responsible. Yes, thank you so much, Lord, Lord Comey, Director of Operations at the I'm Presidency. Grateful. We're grateful for your time as well.